Getting vaccinated. What to bring when you get vaccinated. A mask. Some vaccination locations may require the use of a face covering for all visitors regardless of vaccination status. Your health insurance information if you have it. If you do not have health insurance, that is okay. You do not need health insurance to get the vaccine. Legal ID, if you have one and feel comfortable sharing it. You do not need a legal ID to get the vaccine. Your vaccination card, if you are getting a second dose, an additional dose of mRNA vaccine for people with certain immunocompromising conditions, or a booster dose. Pain medication. It is not recommended to take over-the-counter medications before getting your vaccine to prevent side effects. Taking over-the-counter medicines after getting the shot is okay if you have side effects. Take what you normally would take in that situation. If you take over-the-counter medications for a different condition or pain management, it is okay to take them on your regular schedule even when you are getting the vaccine. Information collected. When you get your COVID-19 vaccine, you will be asked to share your phone name, date of birth, address, phone number, and gender. You do not need to be a resident of Minnesota to get vaccinated here. You will never be asked about your immigration status when getting the COVID-19 vaccine. Getting vaccinated will not impact your eligibility to gain lawful permanent resident status for your green card. You will not be identified as a public charge. The person who gives you the vaccine is required to enter vaccine data into Minnesota's Immunization Information System, the Minnesota Immunization Information Connection, or MIIC. MIIC keeps track of someone's vaccination history and makes sure they get the right vaccinations at the right time. Find more information at About MICC. MICC collects name, date of birth, address, phone number, and various information related to the vaccination itself, administration date, vaccination type, lot number, etc. MDH shares de-identified vaccine data, general information that does not include the person's name, with the federal government or the CDC every day. This means that the data could not be tracked back to a specific person. MDH does not share any information with Immigrations and Customs Enforcement, or ICE. Other vaccines. COVID-19 vaccines can be given at the same time as other vaccines, like the flu vaccine. You can also receive a COVID-19 vaccine if you recently received another vaccine. Cost or insurance. All COVID-19 vaccines are free. However, health care providers can charge an administration fee to insurance companies for giving the vaccine to someone. This means that you might be asked for your insurance information when you get the COVID-19 vaccine. If you have insurance, you should provide that information when you get your vaccine. The administration fee helps cover costs of staffing, space, printing, extra supplies, and more. You can still get the COVID-19 vaccine if you do not have insurance. No one should receive a bill for the vaccine or administration fee. If you get a bill, call the place where you got your vaccine or your health insurance company. 
scams. MDH and healthcare providers are doing some outreach to contact Minnesotans who have not been vaccinated, but they will never ask for your bank account, credit card, or social security number in order to get the COVID-19 vaccine.